Wow, it looks like a different house. Doesn't it? Oh my God. Hi. Hi. Very well thanks. So guys, I realized that I've needed an intro for this vlog. For those of you guys who have missed the last video, definitely check it out. But I want to give you guys a little backstory about this surprise that I have for hubby in today's video. We've been meaning to do our carpets for so long. When we first bought this house, that was one of the main things that we wanted to do. But y'all know, money does not grow on trees. So it's just one of those projects that we just kind of had to wait around until we could actually afford it. Long story short, that time has come and Javi was like over the moon. We we're both, we we're all excited because we just couldn't wait to get this project done. And I just want to point out that this project is actually mostly for the kids in a sense because our basement had like a smooth floor. If you guys saw it before, like I said, check out the video. I should link it here. It had a smooth flooring before and it was just really slippery for kids. Not something that we wanted to have. And so we just couldn't wait to make it more comfortable, like more like a rec room space for the kids. So that being said, that moment arrived and we're so pumped about it. We just couldn't wait. So I did show hubby earlier on in the camera and I just couldn't wait for him to come home and see it in person for himself because the kids and I saw it and we were ecstatic. We were like over the moon. Just getting a carpet in the space transformed the space. I'm telling you, like I've seen it in other houses, but it's not until you have your own home and you start doing your own hub upgrades that you can see like, wow, like you can just see how, you can just see how amazing things can transform and become. Yeah. So I just wanted to point that out to you guys. So you had a clear cut as to what this video is about. The first clip is just a flashback. Um, of me telling hubby and you can just hear how surprised he is so you can only imagine like his surprise or his amazement in real life <laughs> so hope you guys enjoyed today's video hope you guys enjoy my surprise reveal to him um i'm just really happy to share it with you guys this is not just a daily vlog it's kind of like a weekly compilation in a sense so hope you guys enjoy the rest of the vlogs i try to film little snippets um to show you guys some of the things that we were doing throughout the week and just you know yeah i hope you guys enjoy it so don't forget to like today's video don't forget to share it and subscribe if you guys are new and enjoy y'all yeah i wanted to show you it's done it's on facetime can you see Go over there and watch your dad. That's kind of so cool. Yeah, it's so cool. That was so cool. That's really good. You guys. So Aaron's about to see the basement for the first oh my God, time. The I know. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm really excited. Whoa. Wow. It looks like a different house. Doesn't it? Oh we didn't vacuum the carpet. We didn't vacuum the stair yet. Oh, it feels nice. Doesn't it? It's nice on the feet to come down. Come down. Come down. Wow. Is this your... Is this your basin? Oh, it feels nice. The, the, actually, the stairs don't even make as much noise. No, they don't make as much noise anymore. Wow, that's so weird. Yeah. Wow. Holy smokes. It looks so nice down here. Wow. This is amazing. It feels great on your feet. Doesn't it? Oh, this is nice. It's perfect, right? Oh, yeah. It looks that's huge. huge. Yeah. The, the light flooring actually made the, the basement look bigger. You like it? Yeah, really happy. All of us, we're just down here. Aren't you happy? Oh yeah. This is great. Yeah. This feels this feels a lot. Feels nice on the this feet. Is, yeah. Really, really nice. Do you think you want a TV here? We're gonna set it up all set the across there. The TV's going that way. Right. In the same way that we had, we had said. And I have a couch here. Do y'all see that sweat? Look at that. That's a testament to my hard work, y'all. I'm like, I woke up this morning and I don't know, just in a bit of a rut and I'm like, why not just get on the bike? If you guys didn't know, I did move it up to my room. I put it right here. It's not the ideal spot for it. It's probably gonna go downstairs with the rest of the equipment because 
that was the purpose of creating a home gym. It's just that all the equipment seems so far away if you are not like committed to just go to. I think that's a part of the problem is just committing oneself to create about create like specific workout times fit it in go to it no matter what because it's no different than going to a gym if you're going to a gym you book the time and you leave your house and you go to it but when it's at home when you're working out at home it's totally different guys if you've been watching my mommy channel i bought a bunch of caps oh i actually don't think i i showed them in the hall oh they're so stylish they are <laughs> <laughs> Five ways to wear your cap. Yeah, exactly. Vogue. Beret. Yeah. <laughs> the burp. The burp. <laughs> the emo. <laughs> <laughs> Normal. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's only uh, four. We're missing one. Poof. And of course, in my bed, you got this little one. He did, I don't know what was up, but he slept so long last night. Oh my word. Oh, I was so happy. Let me give you something small to fold. Fold this. Take it. Don't be resistant. Okay, go ahead. Fold it nicely, please, sir. Fold it nicely. Oh, you guys didn't see my water bottle. I unbox this baby, and it's basically a motivating water bottle because it has all these sayings on there. So it's almost, let's see, it's almost 11 o'clock. It's 11, it's 10.30, and I'm almost going to be done at the 11 o'clock marker. Good job. You're folding nicely, Zab Zab. Good job. Keep it up. Keep folding. Uh-huh. Good stuff. Going through their clothes is like a nightmare because I feel like every time I put away the bin that, the bin of stuff that they're growing out, you know, I go through it and I take things out, but then something that fit last week or maybe the week before just doesn't fit again. And if it's not Zavi, it's Zoe. And if it's not, you know, it's vice versa. <laughs> So I was about to do a quick little unboxing for you because I just got some mail, but it wasn't that exciting. All that came in the mail were these little cocoa butter sticks. You guys, these are so good to have on hand. Like if you have like eczema or just dry skin, you can use them on your lips. Like I use them on my lips. They say they're good for, for marks and blemishes. I should probably start using it on that. But I ordered three in the past and I really love them. I gave a bunch to some of my kids and then I just ordered some backup. Guys, so I'm about to go for a walk and I just want to show you guys, this is the sunscreen I'm about to put on. It's by La Roche, La Roche Posay because outside is looking really hot and I need to find Zoe's too because we're hydrating ourselves. Ignore the mess in the back. We're actually almost done. Let me give you guys a little update on the house. We almost unpacked everything so we're not that far away, thank God but I can only do so much. Forgot to show you guys this cute little hat that Babe's got for Zavi. It's so cute, it's got the string and it's neutral. It's also reversible. It's got this pattern in there, but it can go with a lot of the stuff. And then my, my mom sent this cute little one. <laughs> this cute little one for him. So adorable with this phone, this phone that he's obsessed with.
Hi guys. I love to greet you guys in natural light if you haven't seen. That's like the thing for me. So good morning. Ignore the back of this portion of the house because you guys know that we heard, um, you guys know that we're still organizing. We're pretty much done though. Have you just picked up some grocery? We just did a little grocery shopping last night. So there's some stuff there that needs to go down to the pantry. That's why it's a little bit chaotic back there. And I'm stepping over like Lego. Have y'all ever stepped on Lego? <laughs> Lego is about just about one of the worst things to step on. That it hurts. But anyways, I am dressed because baby girl and I were about to go for a walk, but then I realized we didn't even eat breakfast yet. Well, I got dressed, but I got dressed to go for a walk, but um, we still need to eat. So I'm on the hunt for some olive oil. Abby picked up this olive oil last night. I don't know if you guys would have seen the vlog yet, but I was saying that this, oh snap, I forgot I left the pot on. Picked up this olive oil last night. I don't know if you guys saw the haul yet, but it's just not one that I'm familiar with, but we're going to give it a try. Olive oil is actually very good for moisturizing your skin. I it, I mean, I think everyone kind of knows this. It's good for hair and stuff, but I do like to mix it sometimes with my lotion because it then gives me... Ooh, it doesn't have me looking all types of ashy out here in the streets. So anyways, that's what I'm about to do. Um, if you guys missed my last haul on my mommy channel, I reviewed this dress there that I got from Shein. It's super cute, but I did order it a size, I think a size big, but at the same time, I don't know. I, yeah, the waistband is supposed to fit a little bit tighter, but I think it's okay. And it's just kind of perfect to go for a stroll so I'm not looking like a hobo because uh, today's the first day of lockdown. So in Ontario, we've been in lockdown for the past month and a half. We are actually able to go into stores for the first time. So I don't know when we're going to go because I feel like everyone's going to be acting like it's summer or like... Well, it is going to be summer. Everyone's going to be acting like it's Christmas or something. They're all going to be running out there trying to do the same thing just because we've been under so much restrictions. And um, despite the fact that it's been for good reasons, it doesn't change the fact that people just want to get out and about. Yesterday, Hubby and I went for a walk and literally everyone was out and about. So I can only imagine. <laughs> <laughs> but it's still exciting news like we can actually go to a store we can actually go and peruse around and just kind of do some you know shopping I guess I don't know we're gonna obviously we still have to wear a mask I believe there still has to be 10% capacity store capacity or something like that like for certain things you have to book appointments you can't just like roll up and go in like you used to but I think it's way better than nothing. So I look forward to that. I definitely look forward to that. You guys, so we are out for a walk real quick. Just trying to get some exercise before the sun is piping hot. I don't know. Today doesn't seem like it's going to be a pretty hot day by any means. Hi. 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 Very well, thanks. Hi. How are you? Yeah, so today doesn't seem like it's going to be that hot because... It's really nice out. Yesterday was like super humid around this time. So by the time I was getting ready to go for a walk, it was just too much. I'm out here with Charlotte. Hey. <laughs> I'm out here with Charlotte and Zoe. And it's actually really, really nice. These days I actually don't have to struggle to come out for a walk. <laughs> I don't have to struggle to get exercise because with all the housework that's going on inside our house, every day I'm closing my ring of like 650 calories burned, which is pretty crazy. It's easier to vlog a little bit like this so I don't look like an awkward, like a weirdo in public with a camera hanging over my head. But um, yeah, just getting out feels really, really nice. We'll see what we end up doing um, in terms of taking advantage of being open again of things being open again we'll see where we go first <laughs> Yay. so guys it's actually really nice out here i was rushing to get out the door because i thought it was going to be super hot no one wants to walk when it's humid not to mention it's not good for the low ones but it's actually really nice
What's going on over here? I was painting my nails. Oh, the other lights on. Yeah, you can't, uh, you can't touch it, okay? Any or else it'll come out. What's Gabriel doing? She's painting me up. <laughs> She's painting your nails? She paints my nails every day. <laughs> I don't think every day, girl. Is this your first time? My first time at beach. My first time at the beach. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, that looks so pretty. <laughs> You're gonna go in for more color. What color is it, Zoe? Uh, purple. Okay, don't see. touch it though, okay? Purple and purple. Purple and purple. Purple and purple. <laughs> Let's wait for it to dry. You like the smell? I like the smell. You like the smell, girl? <laughs> it smells so beautiful. <laughs> Wait a minute. Your nails look so beautiful. They like smells. Girl. Are you having fun? Are you having fun for the pink? Yeah. One. I'll be very gentle with you. Thank you. Let's see these nails so far. Try. You're doing great, honey. I'll be there with you for this. You got a little bit on me. Yeah, don't worry, I'll come on. There. Thank you. Now we just need to, you need to rest your hand right here. Just let it dry, okay? Yeah, just rest it there. Just let it dry. And now we're gonna do the next one. Okay. Tell me when you're ready. I to paint your nails. Yeah, I'll paint mine after. Are you ready? Let's do this. Let's do this now. Rest it right there. Yeah, that's perfect. Ready? I already do said. You need, also, you need to keep your nails on the thing. Yes. <laughs> Let's see these nails though. Does <laughs> that look nice? Because I, I basically chewed off all my nails last night. Left hand looks so nice, the right hand looks like trash. <laughs> <laughs> That's always the worst because like when you're right-handed, it's like the hand that people see the most. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to hire you later. <laughs> Guys, my nails, I'm not sure you can see them, they're always short though. Because I clip them, right, Ma? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys, you guys, I'm down here, okay, trying on some clothes for my fit for my personal channel, and Mick, my assistant. If you guys don't know, she's the one that helps me on the background with with some of this stuff. She is busy taking pictures of me, and it's just hilarious. My cheeks hurt from laughing so much. Not to mention, she's currently wearing all of the clothes that I just tried on. <laughs> la, la, la. Why would you do such a thing? I'm doing the five dress challenge, so I just need to wear the one you're wearing, and then I have five dresses. Right. Plus, they all fit me, <laughs> like, perfectly. Oh my gosh. 
And I did my makeup today. I look. I did my makeup today. I was supposed to pick up the camera to show you guys, but it's just been a busy day because Friday is a day of filming for me. I try to film all the things, including grocery hauls. So there is a grocery haul to come. Um, you will see it before this, <laughs> but probably by the time you're seeing this, it's on to the next grocery haul. Oh, hush, dear sweet child. Don't <laughs> worry. Don't worry. It'll all fall into place someday. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. But this girl kills me, I can't. Yeah, oh my gosh. That one is not gonna fit over all these. <laughs> Wait, it just might.